hello friends welcome to crazytechtricks.com so in this tutorial i would be just telling you the top 10 reasons why your smartphone hangs you must have been facing this problem with your android or whatsoever operating system you are operating in your smartphone but it actually becomes hang it stop working it really doesn't respond uh, about what you are asking and uh, giving the commands and etc so i would be just telling you i would uh, also telling you the how to prevent your smartphone being hanged so let's move forward to it uh, biggest thing uh, i would say while buying a smartphone just don't go for any some sort of a feature which you are looking forward just go for the one of the main feature and that is um, your ram yes ram is one of the most important feature so i would be just guiding you step by step which would be help you in understanding in a better way so what you need to do just open your menu section now you could just go here and just tap on the settings okay now when you just within the setting sections uh, you'll be able to find these applications it can be different options uh, depending upon the smartphone or android phone or whatsoever phone which you are using but it would be quite helpful for you because this is the same process now uh, tap on the application manager in many few phones i will say it just tap on the application and this screen appear but here you need to go to two to three steps to get these options so now i have entered here now just go to the running uh, the running applications so now here comes uh, the main thing which is showing our ram random access memory which we call so it is just showing the system is having using your 876 mb your applications which are just being operated on your smartphone are consuming 226 mb or it's just as you can see just going up and down depending upon the application how much data they are catching and etc and the free is 285 mb so as you know i've been not using any some sort of application uh, rather than opening the settings and using the screen recorder so how these applications are consuming your uh, ram and making your smartphone really work slow so i would be just telling you what you need to do is uh, just go to the back screen home screen now the reason is how uh, I ju you just get the idea that which of your job applications are getting your ram consumed so after just removing that application so we could just really uh, say that settings have been removed so it won't be using your RAM but actually it is using so how it is using because you haven't closed an application now just tap on here as you could see settings still open there are plenty of applications which are open and being operated and consuming your memory so I would recommend you to close all the applications here comes the close the application which is the second thing and while closing the application you would actually uh, realize that your smartphone has worked really in a better way and smartphone uh, now you could just go on uh, using all sort of an applications on your smartphone now another option never update in applications you must be wondering that what i'm actually saying but where that really true uh, usually google just keep on throwing you in their updates of uh, applications these updates are not really given by the google but it's given by the provider yes it's given by the provider uh, of the application the developer because they just find some sort of an interesting applications or the bug free application which they provide you an application so i would recommend you before just improving or updating your application first of all click on this uh, any application which is showing you that you need to update an application uh, in my case it is a game roll the ball so it will just come here what's new it is just saying now you can unlock three additional modes and patch mode is there so it's up to you whether you want to update or not or just go for uh, this application expense manager which tell you how much you are spending and gaining so while you're just opening this application you get to know that while updating what features you will be just getting and if these features are really suitable for you that you could just go on there so with the new you can just probably say that this is one of the most effective spending now can use more than 100 icons i just find these kind of things which are really not interesting not useful for me so i won't be just going to update this application i would also recommend you not to play uh, this google i would say recommend this google play store okay google news stand etc never ever update this application this application just keep on consuming your ram your memory etc and provides you nothing now you must have observed the problem in your the most problem which your people are facing in the facebook application it just gets hanged when you open so how to recover from that again visit to the settings applications it's uh, i would say any application which you are just facing difficulty in using you could just just visit there now here comes a facebook application yeah 
as you could see it the total size of the application is only 222 mb which is a nelson 2 okay uh, but it is saying that total it is 320 mb so the 98 mb is the data whenever you are open your facebook application it just store each and every of your detail what you are searching and etc to provide you better way of uh, improving your services uh, when because of the next time when you just log in so you could just get all these kinds of a things now clear data is option is present here and it's one more thing move to this sd card why not you move it to the sd card yes you heard it right i have just moved it to the sd card to just tell you uh, because i would be just taking it back never ever move your application to the sd card because when sd card your storage device external storage device you store your application then it really increase the chances of being hanged because uh, the amount of the application which are just saved in your smartphone data in your internal storage it's better to store your application in internal storage rather than storing in your external device so never uh, download or update your, your application and move to the sd card so we were just here uh, facing problem with this Facebook. so what are we just going clear data i have just cleared this facebook data now it's just recomputing the size so now what it would actually it would just do nothing rather than just logging out you from the facebook you could just log in back to your facebook account and you would actually feel that now your uh, experience has improved your smartphone is having more space and it could really work well so it's quite good for you to uh, remove all these kinds of an application so i would also say uh, clear catch is the best way to improve your uh, improve on your smartphone and you could just actually uh, be really helpful in your using all these kinds of applications now what is the reason one more thing never ever i would say uh, go to this all these kinds of things there are plenty apk files which are i would say uh, accept source uh, uh, rather than your operating market uh, you go for these kinds of sources and download applications from there on which are really illegal also and also it also affects your smartphone i would say so i would say never ever just go on there and just download all these kinds of applications from your external market there is an account uh, we just show that you are using all these kinds of application on your smartphone and your account is being logged in so always use google play store never go for the external storage of the market it could really affect your smartphone so always make sure that uh, it really doesn't uh i would say uh, update all these kinds of applications in your smartphone and uh, always just uncheck that specific option which is present there which really stop all these kinds of uh application to be downloaded from the external storage so it's really helpful for you and your smartphone it just help in just securing your smartphones your privacy your data and etc so here you could see all these kinds of options are present here and uh, you could just see uh, all these kinds of application which is telling you all these kinds of a thing in the lock screen and security section we have found this option unknown option it's been unlocked if i just go on it which is installing from unknown source it may be harmful for your device which is actually correct uh, it because while you are installing all these kinds of things now just move it to another option to make your smartphone work better i will recommend you to always keep your battery level to 30 percent plus yes battery is one of the most important thing uh, it really help you in just using all these kinds of applications in better way it provides more and more energy for your smartphone so it's really helpful i would say all these kinds of things and one more thing try to remove your memory card uh, once in a week yes it really i would say it's free but it's really helpful memory card your external storage device or remove your battery if uh, your battery is removable or try to restart your phone once in a week that's the minimum minimum time i'm just saying maximum time if you are just going for 24 by 7 then also it's good but i would say you need to restart your phone don't connect your devices with lots of data to through a data cable to your connected your devices okay so it will be helpful for you uh, okay so i would also say uh, these days there are several sort of uh, applications which are just providing to the smartphone so i would say if you just gonna take all these kinds of things and keeping in your mind that you could actually help your smartphone in working in a faster and a better way 
So once again, I would be just guiding you step by step. First one was the RAM. Just reach your RAM section, increase the RAM by just going all these kinds of application and knowing what actually you need to remove, what actually what are the files that actually consuming your RAM so that in the future you could just take an eye on that applications and just improve your uh, performance of your smartphone in a better way so okay and never update an application which is related to Google Google News 10 or Google Games etc these are really silly application and all of, uh, always have a check before updating your application that what they are actually providing you uh, close applications yes one of the most important thing close your keep on closing your applications okay so it would also provide a more uh, space to your RAM to work in a faster way don't uh, install application from an, another source except your Google Play stores or ex except I would say a legal store which is provided by your market or the sections okay so never go on with this section unknown sources etc okay keep your uh, uh, one more thing uh, which you must have been just forgotten uh, and I just forget to guide you I would say antivirus yes it is important to keep antivirus in your smartphone yes of course it really keep on scanning I have just kept AVG uh, is free no chargeable uh, only the upgrade feature allows uh, the removal of ads so I'm really not having problem if also showing me ads so it's quite okay so on the keep antivirus in your smartphone install application in your internal storage never install in memory card remove battery don't connect with too much devices so if you're gonna keep all these kinds of things in your mind that yes your smartphone won't be hanging in the future and if you face any problem still if you are facing and you have some sort of a more questions that you could just comment below thank you i would be very happy to answer your questions thank you thanks for watching this video and do subscribe my channel and share with your friends thank you